The Taiwan Embassy and the International Cooperation and Development Fund, ICDF, under the ICT for Educational Development Project, have facilitated the creation of a smart classroom at the Sufra Comprehensive Secondary School. We have Rajavar Lawrence with a report. The Ministry of Education, Innovation, Gender Relations, Sustainable Development is heightening the integration of Information Communication Technology, ICT, in schools island-wide. The aim is to transform teaching and learning in St. Lucia through the use of appropriate digital technologies that engender a literate, creative, productive, inclusive and competitive society. The Embassy of Taiwan in St. Lucia has been an integral partner in the implementation of the ICT in education strategy. The Embassy, along with the International Cooperation and Development Fund, the ICDF, has provided for the transitioning of a smart classroom at the Sufre Comprehensive Secondary School. Michelle Charles is the Permanent Secretary in the Department of Education, Innovation and Gender Relations. The generous contributions of charging carts, tablets, laptops, projectors, Chromebooks and other equipment sets this school well on a path for infusing technology into its instruction and learning. The presentation today is of tools and equipment necessary for the development of a diverse, educated and resilient people. These are tools and equipment necessary for ensuring that our graduates and teachers are 21st century compliant. Taiwanese Ambassador, His Excellency Peter Chen, has congratulated the Sufre Comprehensive Secondary School for its keen desire in developing student interest in coding and robotics. 100 Acer Chromebook, as you can see, and 50 tablets, numerous integrative displays and projectors will be provided today to the teachers and students of Sufre Comprehensive Secondary School. These equipments are aimed to apply information technology in developing teaching materials for specialized courses and to create a smart learning environment. ICT opens up another dimension of learning. We sincerely hope that through the implementation of the ICT in education, teachers and students will have the opportunity to explore different learning experiences and feel empowered and confident to pursue their passion and dreams. Noting that the program meets the United Nations Sustainable Development Goals 4 and 9, which speak to inclusive and equitable quality education and fostering innovation respectively, Principal of the Sufre Comprehensive Secondary School, Joel Schalmein, hailed the ICT in Education project as a great vision for success in the school system. Thank you, Madam Minister and Madam P.S., for effecting change in the educational landscape of St. Lucia, not only with this project, but also the Pro Futuro Digital Education Program, which will deliver similar benefits to students at the primary school level. Thank you to the Taiwanese government for equipping schools, us, SCSS, with what is needed, the equipment and the digital education training for teachers to be more effective in the classroom so that when students leave here, they are more ready to take on the world. They are critical thinkers, communicators, collaborators, and creative. The fundamental four C's of the 21st century, which will germinate and flourish from integration of ICT in education. Among the items donated to the school are Chromebook tablets, projects, laptops, and projector screens. From the Government Information Service, Rajvaro Lawrence reporting.